Want to speak real Chinese from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at ChineseClass101.com. Hi, 大家好，我是英如。Hi, everyone. I'm Yinru. In this lesson, we'll talk about the ten most commonly used Chinese verbs in everyday life. Our first verb is 吃吃吃 means eat. Eating and food is such a big part of the Chinese culture. Of course, 吃 has to be the first one on our list. 吃 eat.、Um, you can say 吃 pizza, eat pizza, or 吃饺子 eat dumplings. Just like in English, 吃 is to consume or take in anything solid. If you're taking in a liquid, you would use 喝喝 drink 喝喝咖啡 drink coffee or 喝茶 drink tea. 吃 and 喝 right.、Uh, next one on our list is 看看看 means look, see, watch all of the above. Anything, any activity or action you use your eyes with. It's can, okay, and such as when you're window shopping, and someone asks,、um, "Can I help you?" and you can just say,、um, "I'm just looking, can can, okay, can can." But if you're not just window shopping, you're really serious about buying something, you would use this verb, my, my, my is to buy. So are you just looking or are you buying? 是看还是买？看 and 买。Okay, next. 去去去 means to go. Um, go either go some place or go do something. So in Chinese, we often have to put something after 去 For example, 去去机场 go to the airport. 去买东西 go buy things, buy something, go shopping, or 去吃东西 go eat something. So remember, always、um, put you need something after 去 in a complete sentence. You would say 去 plus a place or 去 plus an activity. Okay. For example, you can use this verb after 去玩 Or in the northern part of China, people often put a "er" after the "wan," so making it "war." Either "wan" and "war,"、um, they both mean play. Okay,、uh, you can say "chu war," go play. And、um, unlike in English, you could put a.、Um, Instrument or、um, sports after play in Chinese, war is simply just to have fun for entertaining purposes. So, for example, hanging out with friends is war, and 去 war just simply means go play, go have fun. 去 and war. Okay, next. 听听听 means、um, listen. Or hear anything you use your ear for. Ting. And next is 说说说 means to say, talk, speak. All of the above is 说说听 and 说 Okay. Next, 读读读 means read. Either read. Out loud or read silently, quietly. They're both do, and after do is 写写 means write. You can say 写信 to write a letter, or 写邮件 to write an email. Um, actually, the last four verbs, 听说读写 are um often used as a set phrase. To describe the four important aspects of 
of language learning, not just Chinese learning, language learning before linguistic abilities. Ting, listening, shuo, speaking, du, reading, and xie, writing. Ting, shuo, du, xie. All right, now let's go over the 10 verbs one more time. Chi, chi, eat. He, he, drink. Kan, kan, look. Mai, mai, buy. Chu, chu, go. War, war, play. Ting, ting, listen. Shuo, shuo, speak. Du, du, read. Xie, xie, write. Okay, next. You're going to hear a dialogue between two friends over the phone. Okay, I'm going to read it, but while I'm reading, I want you to take note of the verb, where the verb is, and how it is used in a sentence. Ready? 你在干嘛? 我在听歌. One more time, a bit slower. 你在干嘛? 我在 did you find it? Did you find the verb? Right, it's right here. Ting, which means listen. Ting, and what is after ting? Ge, ge means song. So ting ge together is a verb phrase meaning um, listening, listen to songs or listen to music. Actually, tingu is a very uh, native way uh, to say listen to music because most of the time, most of the time, when we listen to music, we listen to songs with a lyric. So, wo tingu means to listen to music. And the whole sentence goes, wo zai tingu, which means I'm listening. To music. 我在听歌. Okay, so what is the first line? What's the question? 你在干嘛? 你在干嘛 means what are you doing? 你在干嘛? 你在干嘛? It's very common. Very colloquial way to ask, what are you doing? And Nizekama is often used as a small talk between close friends and people who know each other very well. Nizekama, So if you're not listening to music, let's say you're watching TV. Okay, do you remember how to say watch or look and see? Yes, can, can, okay, and TV in Chinese is 电视, okay, 电视, so 看电视 means to watch TV, so I'm watching TV is 我在看电视, 我在看电视, now how about you are eating, you're having dinner, remember how to say eat? Chu So Chu Shamana Chu what dinner in Chinese is Wan Fan Wan Fan literally is um late meal or evening meal or dinner Chu Wan Fan Eat dinner or have dinner So I'm eating dinner is Wo Zai Chu Wan Fan Wo Zai Chu Wan Fan Now here is our pattern. 
Okay, to say you are doing something, I'm doing something. Okay, you can use 我 plus 在 plus a verb, and oftentimes a verb is followed with an object. Okay, 我在 verb object. 我 means I, and 在、um, 在 literally it's、uh, means at. Okay, but when 在 is followed by a verb, 在 does not mean at. You can see 在 in this case as a progressive tense marker. So whenever you see a 在 with a verb, that means something is happening right now. 在 plus verb and plus object. I am doing something or I literally is I at something, but I am doing something. It's、so、our pattern here. 我在 verb object. For example, 我在 verb 听 object 歌。我在 verb 看 object 电视。我在 verb 吃 object 晚饭。Okay, 我在 verb object. Do you remember how to say listen? Ting, ting, and how to say song? Ge. Do you remember the progressive tense marker? Zai, zai. And do you remember how to say I'm listening to music? Wo zai ting ge. 我在听歌。Do you remember how to say eat? Eat, eat. And how to say drink? Drink, drink. Do you remember how to say look? Can and how to say bye? My, my. Do you remember how to say go? Chu, chu. And how to say play? War, war. Do you remember how to say read? Do, do. And how to say write? Write, write. And do you remember how to say speak? Shuo, shuo. Well done. In this lesson, you've learned top ten verbs in Chinese. Thank you for watching. I'm Yin Ru, and I'll see you again on ChineseClass101.com. See you. Want to speed up your language learning? Take your very first lesson with us. You'll start speaking in minutes and master real conversations. Sign up for your free lifetime account. Just click the link in the description.